So the pattern this week is um, uh, just try and get some things done between tours. Um, but what I'm going to do is because I made a mess of a bit of filming last night, uh, we're going to go quickly to last night and then we're going to come back to today. So I was going to do a job um, until I discovered a crucial part was missing. So I'm abandoning that job and I bet you're wondering what it is. But as soon as the part comes, then we'll get going on that. But in the meantime, what can I be doing? Let's get some more battens up. This is easy. I can just drop in, do a few more battens. I'll be taking a step forward every time I do it. was fun wasn't it now let's just get on with the day what you saw me do last night um, barely did a dent in the uh, batteries um, the big difference of course when you're running the generator the generator is producing electricity all the time even when you're not using it but because we're only doing zip 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 um, the batteries are like yeah, that's fine. So it's not having a huge impact on the power. So it's great. It'll just keep going and going and going. As you can see, the boat is insulated on the water line, um, but it's not insulated at the top. Because I have insulation and because I have wood, I want to use it up. So that's why I'm sort of tackling a little bit of work here on the roof. Um, so I have a little plan to do a bit more insulating up on the roof. Hence all of this lovely new wood going in. I have to carve out niches in the wood so that they can pass through the wood. And that's sort of what I'm going to do today. Ages ago, I bought this and it's, uh, I think it's, I think it's, four, it's, I don't know how many meters, but it's a full roll of calico. I was inspired by stately homes that used to drape um, silk on the walls instead of, because they didn't have wallpaper. Put the insulation in, keep it in the roof by using calico stapled into the wooden beams and then um, a later date then do the proper cladding. So the other point then is with the calico up on the roof holding the insulation in uh, the boat is a bit more efficient and warm um, and in time I can put the wooden panelling in. Uh, wooden panelling is not a priority, what's a priority is getting a, a cooker and a shower and a heating system and a hot water and that kind of thing. So this is just a nice cheap and simple way of getting to somewhere where the place is habitable and then over time put the wood in. This is the beast. I managed to get this second hand for 200 pounds. Normally it's about 350, 400 pounds. Um, it is DeVault's top of the range um, router. Uh, if I can open it. And what's remarkable is the guy who sold it um, barely used it. So you can see it's in beautiful condition. It's also upside down. Um, but basically, this is going to be very, very important to me. It is also 2,300 watts, hence the 3,000 watt inverter. Nice! So that was my first attempt, and then that was my second attempt. That... goes in there. I 
had a little change of mind. Two channels. I'm going to need more room for cables, so um, there's plenty of space now there. So before I put these patterns in, I just wanted to make sure that this was all smoothed out. that one in there to do and I have to sort out in here okay so these panels need to come down <laughs> There's a teeny bit of rust there, which, and I noticed um, I just wiped it away, but there's just a bit of damp. So I think there might be a leak. of all the mess and the sawdust I have here there's also a smell of sort of a, a, a piney a frankincense kind of a smell as well it reminds you of a, the inside of a church which is nice <laughs> This board I'm about to put up is a piece of plywood. Um, my intention is that later on there'll be a nice piece of wood put on the outside of the plywood. So it's just there to get the insulation up um, and to hide the electrics. But it'll only be screwed in by a handful of screws um, because it'll be coming on and coming off as I add electricity later on. So it's just while I have nothing else to do, might as well use this wood and get the insulation up there.
Nice and flush here, which is what I want, and, and then the roof can go down that way, and I can uh, do this as well. I need to think about where the lamps are going to go. So there's going to be a lamp there that will have a pointy down onto what will be the cooker, I suppose, and then there'll be a similar lamp over there pointing down right into the middle of the table on the diner. bit of a ceiling. So I just want to get this roof insulated just so that I feel I've finished something. So I'm just going to get on with that. It is freezing, but because I'm only here for, a, I hope, an hour, I'm not putting the fire on. So I'll just have to man up. Remember that this is just keeping the insulation in and then the boards can go over when I get that done. I told you he was mad. Sure hasn't he made himself a padded cell. <laughs> Feckin' Egypt.